From the brink of death to receiving an award as Horse of the Year, Sutter the Horse has gone through a lot in his 30 years. Certainly has. KCOI 12's Melissa Newman has more on this local horse and how some people are saying he's becoming an ambassador for wild horses across the country. You might think of them as just tales of the Old West, but there are close to 70,000 wild horses left in the U.S. Sutter is one of them. This tattoo on his neck was imprinted when he was captured in Nevada at two years old. His abuse started shortly after. He was tied up uh, with his legs very close to his chest. He was thrown under a hot tarp. Uh, he was um, kept from food and water. And all this was uh, a, a way to try to break his spirit so he could be more manageable for this person. Because of all the years of suffering, Sutter would not and could not trust people. It wasn't until months after he was rescued did he start to trust people again. He became one of the more, most curious horses that anyone who knows him knows because he's just naturally curious, very social, and he wants to be involved with everything. Sutter's role with people is why he's being recognized as Horse of the Year by the ASPCA. His caretakers believe he's doing a lot to reintroduce the idea of wild horses into people's lives. Near Lompoc, Melissa Newman, KCOI 12 Central Coast News. And Sutter's handlers say it's amazing to have a horse that people can get close to and hear about his history and heritage.